Hello guys and welcome back to The Mood. Today we are the 8th of July 2021 and guys that was my prediction from yesterday. I told you guys we would spike up up there exactly and bounce there and dump so I'm still super super <laughs> accurate during all these moves guys. Did you see I planned this one, this one, this one, this one, this one and this one yesterday. You can check back and go see my videos from yesterday. Sorry, that's for later. You can check back and go see my videos from yesterday. You will see that I predicted that perfectly. So guys, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing to it right now. And uh, without further ado, we are going to check out what's gonna happen today on Bitcoin Doge that I'm still in since this morning. And also we are going to make a complete analysis of Solana. So welcome back. I mean, I'm trying to figure out how to make this video more entertaining, guys. You'll be very welcome to leave tons and tons of likes to it so it trends on YouTube and we can go over all those bad traders that are around on the top list. My God, there are so many bad traders. So guys, first of all, I want to say something. Uh, recently, we had the Tiger King crypto that was uh, trending and that did a lot of us and that is completely spiking look at this no that's their website but look at this this is recent it's spiking like this okay it's a small crypto it's on um it's on it's not pancake swap it's uniswap i wouldn't recommend at all to buy it uh, just the fact is that the fact that this crypto is right now trending and it has such a pump is a sparkle we shouldn't ignore in this market because each and every bull market started with a small sparkle like this one so it's important it's something very important to notice guys what about our bitcoin price so i got it absolutely right over that uh, move right here and uh, it went much further down than I was thinking, but I'm not surprised we hit a resistance line here. Elon Musk did also a nice little tweet this morning that probably helped us to maintain this market quite uh, above these limits and to make a higher high. So that's probably our bottom, I guess. And um, we have to check out what's happening here. Our VIX is bouncing, but that's not sufficient. Our new indicator is showing us that we are nearly on the bottom of that channel and we are on the four hour chart on the daily chart. We are still we still have dump possible. But if we break that resistance line, there is much more dump to come. Uh, I don't think it's that probable when we look at the four hour. We got a slight little bit more of a dump possible. And at that point, the most probable, let's have a look at the two hour. The two hour seems perfectly fine. The two hour indicates a real, real bounce. So that's probably it for today. That's probably it. I don't see any major move. I think we are going to range here, probably maybe retest a little bit down, but that's the kind of move we can expect for today on Bitcoin. And you can look at the two hour chart. That's what we might get. So probably a return to 32,700. So guys, that 32 level that I was calling since a week, it happened. It happened while everybody was like, oh yeah, the week off. Look at the week off, we have to do it. So subscribe guys, subscribe, subscribe. That's all I can say that week off that everybody wanted didn't happen that's why i don't trade patterns okay my doge coin position is fine i entered back around here when i woke up so we got to get back to to my point so i can make profit we got exactly the same kind of signal the four hour is much more bullish than the bitcoin uh chart so I think I don't think we are going at that low on these levels. Even if this resistance line here is not completely reached, I would say the same. That's the kind of move I would expect today on Dogecoin. And by the way, we are going to make a higher high also here. So overall, it's very, very, very positive, guys. 
I think for the first time I see a few positive signs on this dumping market and I told you on the weekly I'm extremely bullish guys and I'm gonna show you why again on the weekly I'm extremely extremely bullish I think our bounce is well deserved because we have all this huge accumulation phase we are very very low very very low last time we went low on my new indicator it was back in the 26th of november 2018 at the lowest of the last bull run so i'm extremely bullish okay there is no doubt now we are just trying to make the most benefit the most profit out of this market without investing more money because at some point we cannot buy all the dips we have to exit the market when the big action comes guys don't forget to subscribe the mood i give you the best indications and you got my twitter handle right here we also have a coin if you want check out in the comments the mood coin so i was telling you we are going to have a look at solana and solana is beautifully trending uh, over that resistance line we are on the four hour chart so we are first going to check the action here all this move by the way <coughs> Everything you see on this drawing was there. I didn't make it after. It was there. You can check back my analysis, guys. <laughs> Am I the best trader around here, around YouTube with all these phony, phony, phony traders everywhere that just want to refer links? Okay, the daily... <clears throat> the daily is mixed. It's quite hard to figure out anything over the daily. The daily would tell me we are on a, on a perfectly ranging cycle. Perfectly ranging, guys. So with upside. And I'm getting the same vibe right here. So we are ranging on Solana. I wouldn't expect crazy stuff. If you want to know right now for today, today is going to recover. Today is going to recover. We are quite high on the RSI. And uh, it's going to recover like the rest. We had this morning dump. We'll wait for the American hours, trading hours to come. Uh, <clears throat> on the long term, we can go check on the weekly too. On the long term, it's not bad at all. I think Solana is going to trend around that resistance line for now i don't see anything insanely bullish or, or i mean on the on the technical analysis of course we can have some crazy news <coughs> and any crazy news any pump can lead us back to 54 dollar but if we are reasonable we are ranging <coughs> over that resistance line sorry i don't have covid i'm fully vaccinated <laughs> okay guys so that's gonna be it i think for today thank you so much for watching this video i'm uploading on a very daily basis i'm trying to lead you in this market that is very cruel was very cruel recently lots of people left but there is a sparkle of hope don't invest in tiger but uh, it's something nice also if you want to support the channel there you go it's the time you can donate on the <coughs> dogecoin wallet right here so I'm going to leave it for a few seconds so you can scan it with your phone. Uh, if you got uh, Binance, you can just scan in and send a few little coins there. Why not? It's just supporting the channel. Oh, you, have, you have the mood coin right down there also in the comment section, guys. Okay? <clears throat> so thank you very, very much for watching. And I'll see you tomorrow. Have a fantastic day. Have a great day. Don't believe uh, the FUD. We are going to bounce. This is going to be an amazing last quarter is just gonna take some time to take off we need to get uh rid of all the the last invest investors that's the, what the market is doing sucking the money out of each investor new investor wave and then attract another one so we are now going to attract another one <laughs> altogether. thank you and i see you tomorrow bye bye